Franz de Frigger, after 1883 Franz von de Frigger, was born April 30, 1835, died January 2, 1921. He was an Austrian artist known for producing genre art and history paintings set in his native county of Tyrol. De Frigger moved to Innsbruck and studied wood carving with the sculptor Michael Stolz, a professor at the Innsbrucker Trade School. Stoltz soon recognized De Frager's greater talent as a painter, and in the autumn of 1860, he arranged a meeting with Karl von Piloty at the Academy of Fine Arts in Munich. At Piloty's suggestion, De Frager attended a preparatory class at the Academy with Hermann Dyck. On July 19, 1861, De Frager passed the entrance examination and was accepted into the Academy. In the autumn of that year, he enrolled in a painting class given by Hermann on Schutz. De Frigger traveled to Paris to enhance his studies at the Academy. During his time in Paris, De Frigger's work was influenced by his experiences in the city and through autodidactic study at museums, art collections, and studios. After spending two years in Paris, De Frigger returned to Munich in July 1865 and began studying under Piloty at the Academy. During the next few years, De Frigger also spent time in East Tyrol, painting portraits of his relatives and friends. Between 1867 and 1870, he worked with Hans Machert and Gabriel of Max in the studio of the Munich history painter Piloty. His paintings were popular, and he soon became successful as an artist. He was professor of history painting from 1878 to 1910 at the Munich Art Academy. He preferred portraits, rustic motifs from the everyday life, and dramatic scenes from the Tyrolean National Uprising of 1809. In 1883, De Frigger was given the Order of Merit of the Bavarian Crown, and was made a Knight of the Collected Personal Nobility. He received numerous prizes and awards, including the Prussian Order of Merit for Science and the Arts. In 1906, his work was displayed at the Century of German Art Exhibition in Berlin.